Yo, what up YouTube? Rotocut Gaming here bringing you another cryptocurrency related video and today I'm going to be talking about the 3080 Ti and the modifications I did to the backplate using these thermal pads that you see on the screen. Um, I didn't want to go too crazy with my thermal pad modifications so the only thing I wanted to do was the backplate mod. I already done that on a 3080 already so this is very similar. Um, just showing here that the uh, the process is really not that crazy, that not that intrusive, um, and you really shouldn't void your warranty. I think there's a little sticker that you go through when you go and and you open this up, but really it shouldn't have, it shouldn't void anything. Um, these things uh, are not really that intricate to take off. The back plate is not really connected to anything. I just you know took it off really easily. Um, and here is in its full glory trying to measure uh, the, the little thermal pads. And they're 20 bucks a pop, so you really don't get a lot of real estate coverage with them. So I, I bought two of them. You might think 20 bucks is, is, is a lot, but hey, I want my temperatures to be low. So part of the PC master race, right? Uh, high FPS, low temperatures. And um, I'm trying to get uh, good coverage here. Cutting them up to to the right uh, size. It's not the prettiest, but it doesn't have to be. I just want to be able to cover all the little modules here, and uh, that that I was able to do some research um, when I when I did my 3080 Ti, trying to find out which ones I need to cover, and that's exactly what I'm doing over here. Um, and just just to reiterate the reason i did this is because i wanted to low lower the memory temperature junction um the issue that i have here i'll show the temperatures that that the the before and the after um here it is what it looks like in its full glory i guess and it looks kind of chopped up it's not the prettiest like i said but it, it gets the job done i just want to make sure that um the three millimeters that i used touch both the back plate and the and and the components Here's a picture of, of what it looks like when it's all laid out flat. Um, and here I, I was trying to make sure that it, it really does touch both and it kind of sandwiched it itself in. It's not the prettiest, like I said, but hey, it works, right? And, and at least I know that, that it's been uh, dissipated, so the heat. So here's the, the, the temperature that I was getting before. Um, I had this rig uh, mining Ravencoin for a full day. Uh, the mem temperature um, reached 98 degrees Celsius. I wasn't happy with that, so I decided to do this backplate mod only, and I wanted to see, hey, am I am I improving? And when I when I fired it, fire fire the whole thing up, immediately within a minute, I was getting like 90 degrees Celsius. So I thought, hey, you know, eight eight degrees reduction, that's fantastic, but you know, it, it's un unrealistic. A minute. Of of mining Raven coin, it's not really indicative of of what it's gonna be uh, long uh, long term. So I uh, I wanted to wait a little bit longer to see it, it stabilize. And as you can see, the uptime is like an hour and twelve minutes already, and it it really centered around ninety two degrees Celsius. Um, so super happy in that sense, right? Uh, six degrees. Uh, reduction from 98 to 92 it's a little bit on the high side in 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 some sense but at least it's not approaching 100 degrees now these things go all the way up to like 110 before they start throttling but i i don't even want to be anywhere close 100 so for me to get 92 uh, degrees here rate mining raven coin great I'm, I'm happy with that with this 3080 ti um, and I don't plan on doing any more modifications. I think that I'll, I'll stick with that. I'll probably buy a, a nice uh, static pressure fan, um, and I'll put it right on, on top of the back plate and see if I can get any improvements on that. And you know, I'll, I'll post my results. But yeah, just just a, a quick video. I appreciate you guys clicking on it. Uh, show you guys what what improvements I made, and um, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Let me know if you have any questions. See ya.